Hi everyone, this is Julio421 here to help you solve the puzzle of level 2165 in Candy Crush Saga, which is a hard level. We can tell by this uh, purple uh, background on the skull here. Um, it's actually a points level. Now, we don't have usually many two hard points levels. We've got 25 moves to reach the one star of points. Now, I've already beaten this level, so I know what it's like. I've got to... Um, basically um, help get these ticking time bombs down and then create chaos. I don't actually remember what my target is. It's wanting me to get a false target from when I beat the level a couple of hours ago. So what I want to do here is create cascades and match a color bomb with the most prevalent ticking time bomb. I think that will create more chaos as this here goes on. I'm hoping to get some specials. There we go. There's wrapped candy. There we go. Get that cascade. Set things off. But I want to be careful here. I don't want to hit the ticking time bombs too early. I'm getting close. I'm working on the more damaging ticking time bombs first before I do anything. Like this one right here is probably going to be uh, the most difficult to get. There we go. Cascades. There we go. Striped wrapped combo. That's going to be a great boost to add to my points here. Okay, let's definitely do this. Ah, I stink. I wanted that striped wrapped. But look at. We got it. We got one star of points. And it was my first playthrough for recording purposes if we can reach this bomb. Uh oh. Yeah, we got it. We got it. Phew. Alright, so now I'm no, I have no damage to worry about here. I can just keep on rolling here. So that's the good news. So that's how I beat this level. Oh look, there's a color bomb. So now I'd probably match it with the most prevalent ticking time bomb color, which I have all the different colors. So I'm just going to go with purple, because I've got a lot of purple on the board. It collects that sugar drop. I've got seven now, so I'm just creating chaos. Now this won't do any damage to me because I've already got the zero the, the zero moves mark. And again, it wouldn't it would not do any damage if I had zero moves left. It's only if I have more than zero moves left where the ticking time bomb will cause damage. And that is how I beat this level. It was my first playthrough for recording purposes. Um, so it wasn't awful, but it was a hard level, and I think the hardens of it was the board shaped, but that's how I beat this level. If you'd like to see more videos, you could subscribe. If you have any questions or comments, please put those below, and as always, thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.